bar is locked into place and cannot be opened. What do I do then? Let's see. Um, the uh, locked into place. Let's see what they say. On the interwebs. Okay, so we can't open that, but... There we go. That was what people said. On the internet. difference but the ones that has like the burning marks oh potions oh shit man I'm pretty getting pretty full Not certain how you managed to get your hands on that item we discussed, but I'm more than pleased. I thought you were simply to wait until it was being transported from Castle Dua to its final destination, but according to what I've heard, it vanished right from the armory. I wish I knew how you were able to just slip by the guard, bypass the uh, plot coolest. Unlock the armory door and break into that dwarven puzzle locked chest. You'll need to teach me that little trick some time. I've left your cut in the usual drop of a. Nice, without breaking a lockpick. Carrying too much, okay. the fishing rod but I haven't gone out to fish the Alduin okay yes oblivion crisis by 10. That way vault. I have to get up. Up from this place. A fine house though. It's just so, like, it's big and needs to be cleared up for a bit of uh, the shit.
There we go. Do I have? Um, hello. My damn Mercer to come back here. Sets one foot in the cistern and I, cut it all. Down. Yes. Well, let's just get this over with. It's not cursed, Elvin. Okay. My damn Mercer to come back here. Sets one foot in the cistern and I'll cut it all. We've scoured the town and I've spoken to every contact we have left. No, no sign, sign of Mercer. Mercer. Any luck on your end? Shore's beard. He's going after the eyes of the Falmer? That was Gallus' pet project. If he gets his hands on them, you can be certain he'll be gone for good and set up for life. Agreed. He's taken everything the guild has left, and to go after one of the last greatest heists is just an insult. I've spoken to Carlia and made amends for how the guilds treated her. Now she wishes to speak with both of us. Quickly, we have no time to lose. Nope. Next we meet live. Trading restored. Why down? Do you need something? Are you broken again? Come here a second. Brynjolf, the time has come to decide Mercer's fate. Until a new guildmaster is chosen, the decision falls to you. He was teaposing earlier. And I've come to a decision. Mercer Frey tried to kill both of you. He betrayed the guild, murdered Gallus, and made us question our future. He needs to die. You have to be very careful, Brynjolf. Mercer is a nightingale. An agent of Nocturnal. And it's all true. Everything I heard in the stories. The Nightingales, their allegiance to Nocturnal, and the Twilight Sepulchre. Yes. That's why we need to prepare ourselves and meet Mercer on equal footing. Just outside of Rift. Beyond the southeast gate is a small path cut up the mountain slide. At the end of that path is a clear and an old stand in the stone. I'd ask you both to meet me there. Yes. Now we go. But uh, I want to get up from here. Map. No, it's just there, but I'll go back to my own base just to, or to my own house, just to get uh, rid of some of the items that are on me, because I probably have. Well, I have some items from the guy. Vampire Seduction Net. Let's see, do I have any ores on me? No. This chest is massive. Weapons. Uh, store. Oh. This does more damage now. Unfavorite. Saw. Favorite. Equip. Um, health. No, no. Potions, stamina, invisibility, store. Okay. Let's 
scrolls. Yeah, put that in. Ingredients. Oh. I can put that away. So much shit on me. There we go. I think that should be enough. And then I can go back to Riften. And see if I can meet. to go so there was such a waste of time preaching to the poor if they're that hungry you every time I look at you my blood boils oh shut the fuck up Master around here. What did you want? I want to get back to Skyrim. Outside of Rift, then there should be a warehouse here. That's one of the quests, I believe. Yeah. Let those two. I just want to get something I can fast travel to. I'm glad you're here. This is the headquarters of the Nightingales. Cut into the mountainside by the first of our kind. We've come to seek the edge we need to defeat Mercer Frey. If you'll follow me, I'll try to explain on the way. This way, please. This must be the... going in here okay good in um so this is nightingale hall i heard about this place when i joined the guild but i never believed it existed the assumption that the nightingales were just a myth was seeded within the guild on purpose it helped divert attention from our true nature what's wrong brynjolf i can almost hear your brow furrowing i'm trying to understand why i'm here last I'm no priest, and I'm certainly not religious. Why pick me? This isn't about religion, Brynjolf. It's business. Spin, eh? 
equip the armor. I think we should trust the lass and take the deal. This hole. So it said sit down the hall. Serve as a guardian. Okay. Aye, there's always a catch. But at this point, I suppose there isn't much to lose. If it means the end of Mercer Prey, you can count me in. I'm a vampire, I'm nocturnal. What about you? Are you ready to transact the oath with Nocturnal? Good. After I open the gate, please stand on the Western Circle. The Western Circle? I think we should trust the last. That's this one. We'll speak when the oath is complete. What was this? Stand vacant on the. Okay. Let's stand on this one over there. Yeah, that one. We'll speak when the oath is complete. Well, let's just open the fucking thing. Have to make your head spin, eh? We'll speak when the oath is complete. Please, uh, I call upon you, Lady Nocturnal, Queen of Murk, and Empress of Shadow. Hear my voice. Ah, Carlyle. I was wondering when I'd hear from you again. Lose something, did we? My lady, I've come before you to throw myself upon your mercy and to accept responsibility for my failure. You're already <laughs> mine, Carlyle. Your terms were struck long ago. What could you possibly offer me now? I have two others that wish to transact the oath. To serve you both in life and in death. You surprise me, Caroline. This offer is definitely weighted in my favor. My appetite for Mercer's demise exceeds my craving for wealth and grace. Revenge. How interesting. Very well. The conditions are acceptable. You may proceed. You may proceed. Lady Killing Lord. We accept your turn. We dedicate ourselves to you as both your avengers and your sentinels. We will honor our agreement in this life and the next until your conditions have been met. Very well. I name your initiates Nightingale, and I restore your status to the same, Carlyle. And in the future, I'd suggest you refrain from disappointing me again. Exacted the oath. It's time to reveal the final piece of the puzzle to you. Mercer's true crime. Mercer was able to unlock the guild's vault without two keys because of what he stole from the Twilight Sepulchre. The skeleton key. By doing this, he's compromised our ties to Nocturnal and in essence, caused our luck to run dry. Well, yes. 
But the key isn't only restricted to physical barriers. All of us possess untapped abilities. The potential to wield... Well, I already do that because I'm the Dragonborn, you see. I can shout. And I can absorb dragons. Although it would benefit the guild more than you can imagine, in the end, if the key isn't returned to its lock in the Twilight Sepulchre, as time passed, our luck would diminish to the point of non-existence. And whether you know it or not, our... Very true. In our line of work, it's quite rare we set out to return a stolen item to its rightful owner. Before we depart, Brynjolf has some business to discuss. I suggest you listen Some business? Listen, lad. There's one last piece of business we need to settle before we go after Mercer. The leadership of the guild. Carlia and I had a long discussion before you arrived here. Thanks to your efforts, Mercer's treachery has been exposed. After we deal with him, all that remains is restoring the guild to its full strength. As a result, we both feel that you have the potential of replacing Mercer as the leader of the Thieves' Guild. I've been at this game a long time, my friend. A long time. I've stolen trinkets from nobles and framed priests for murder. I'm good at what I do. Maybe even one of the best. But it's all I know. But I've never been one to lead. Never desired it. Never cared for it. Don't want it. You want to become the leader? Well, we have a bit of an errand to run before your coronation. So don't get sentimental on me now. Then it's decided. When this is all over and Delvin's contacts assure me that we've regained our footing in Skyrim, we'll handle the details. Until then, okay. we have quite the task. So ahead. I'm becoming the leader of. I've been pouring over the plans you brought us, and I'm convinced the, the thieves' the guild are in the Dwarven ruins at Urkenfat. Carlia and I will meet you there. Prepare yourself, Prepare yourself lad. lad. This will be a fight to remember. Aye. And some of what Carlyle said is that Mercer may have damaged our reputation and raided our coffers. Old Delvin kept calling it a curse, and we all laughed at him. Looks like the joke's on. If you would have asked me that yesterday. Look, call me crazy if you like, but I trust Carlyle. I don't think. Besides, turn around and go back on. Um... Mercer's blood on my blade, and spend the rest of my. What? This. Regretting that I ran the other way. Until next we meet, my. Hmm? Gallus, Mercer Frey, and I. The Trinity disbanded 25 years ago when Mercer Frey betrayed us by slaying Gallus indirectly. The Trinity is usually selected from the ranks of the Guild, although it's existent. The Nightingales protect the Temple of Nocturnal. She's the mistress of night and darkness. Nocturnal isn't one for worship and reverence. She influences our luck. You're closer to understanding. The only difference is she doesn't demand payment in the traditional sense. Whether you know it oh, sorry, I'm, I'm just trying to like dictates how well we perform as follow on. Again, you have to think differently. Like a novice, it's through these subtle means that noc Nocturnal's whim is... The I'm just trying to follow on what is happening because I don't think I've done like any stuff with the Thieves' Guild. Die? When we suffer, the return certainly seems worth the risk, though. Yes. Now that you are, you'll find that this place offers many things that will help you. Once the skeleton key has been restored to the Twilight Sepulchre, I'll make this place mine. With the skeleton key missing from the Twilight Sepulchre, I'm afraid you merely transacted the oath. Signed the unwritten co In order for us to receive our abilities, our end of the bargain, if Nocturnal was truly displeased with me, with any... I have no doubt that we still hold her favor, and I believe it gives us enough of an edge to defeat Mercer Frey. Is this light armor? Fine. Okay, so this could be the last mission of the Thieves Guild, and then I could possibly get. I don't know. I don't know how the thief skill thing works. Do I just get income, or 
Do I have to do something to get money, or is it just like a title I bring? <clears throat> Good thing I have this trouble point. Uh, I will, in this case, bring on my... Normal armor. Yeah, that makes me slower. It's just gives me a little more armor. It makes me feel like I don't take as much damage. Plus, it gives me the two handed bonus, which I kind of like. Um, but I need to train up my one handed sometime soon. When I find like. A good weapon. Okay. Yeah. yeah, there we go. There we go. to have an channel this now. So we'll do uh, like a bunch of damage. But even like without being um, enchanted it still does a lot of damage. next. Down we go. That's like all this old stuff behind. Mercer's been here. I hope we aren't too late. Brynjolf and I found them like that. We have to catch up to him before it's too. We should tread carefully. I wouldn't be surprised if he's left behind a few surprises for us. Well, uh, then I should. Yeah. Also. There we go. We have to get the key back. I don't see him versus down there. But it's probably where he's gonna be at the fight is kind of happen. say anything except I'm on it less
Okay, so I can get even more shielding if I do heavy shield or uh, heavy armor and that. Um to get to the other side. Is there one down there? Mystery. Oh, to figure out where the other thing is where I can um the machinery. That's ready. Should open up the door. Oh. I thought she was the one that hit me. Probably an archer down here. Okay, so I need to go up here. Press the button on this. Do they? So there's a timer on it, okay. I see. That's how it's supposed to be. it open. Yeah, good. Then we can go through. And I should heal up. Looks like we can take the low road or the high road across. Your choice. So it's to the pain then. But they, they, them, um, I'm going this way, and there seems to be no enemies at all this way. Oh, there's one. Falmus attack him. people they're still attacking that one person oh that one I saw those on the floor the torches it's empty as well scroll of detect light life is this door just want to open or yep
Oh, there they are. That guy's probably gonna come to life. Ocean ceiling. Heavy armor. Oh shit, that's one behind me. There you go. This, this is actually the way I to go up. Is he gain health? Nope. Yeah. Please regen some health, man. You say fight. I know this is for the week. But you're the one that doesn't fucking heal up. Let the spiders coming down now. Where's this one that's... Oh, there. Well, I'm just gonna go up here then. Talk to all the spiders, my friends, you know. <laughs> Slave pens. Uh, do the Palmer also have no sense of smell? Ah! That like what you're trying to heal up and then it pretty annoying one. Okay. Does it actually have anything in here that's useful? Or is it... The ingots? Fork? No. No. Okay. The ingots. That's it. Some of them don't give... Really don't give anything. Be quite annoying. What was that? Thieves' last word. Let's see. Nobody thought they were real, but I've seen them. The eyes of the snow elves. The dwarves thought they took them from the farmer, but they themselves were fooled. A statue were 
built in secret by the slaves. The eyes burn into you, and I see them even now. Safra escaped through the collapsing tunnel, but he will never escape what I what we've seen. Men will never believe him. Ba-da-dum, ba-da-dum, ba-da-dum. Wait there, is this the way it's supposed to go up? Or this way? Probably. The roofing is pretty cool, huh? Nope, that's not the way up. Oh, this way. What was that? Oh. Oh, the weak? Well, get, get up here and fucking back instead of being at the back. Almost level 100 with this shit now. Fuck, man, I've been using 200 for long. Can you please, uh, thank you? Do like about a hundred damage. You know there's weapons that do like a lot more damage than this, but also like when you really look into it, I see that I haven't really done anything regarding new weapon like creating and getting materials and all that stuff. Wait. What level? What level am I? Okay, twenty-eight. Down multiple times. I must prepare myself. Yes, I just did. Just healed myself up. Plus, I have a level so I can quickly. He's here, and he hasn't seen us yet. Bernyov, watch the door. Your follow can I come in here? But they've never been there. Nothing's get by me. Climb down that ledge. See if you can. Carlia, when will you learn you can't get the drop on me? Oh, what? Oh. I didn't thought it was got seen. When Brynjolf brought you before me, I could feel a sudden shift in the wind. And at that moment, I knew it would end with one of us at the end of a blade. What's Carlia been filling your head with? Tales of thieves with honor, oaths ripe with falsehoods and broken promises. Nocturnal doesn't care about you, the key, or anything having to do with the guild. 
Revenge, is it? Have you learned <laughs> nothing from your time with us? When will you open your eyes and realize how little my actions differ from yours? Both of us lie, cheat, and steal to further our own end. It's clear you'll never see the skeleton key as I do, as an instrument of limitless wealth. Instead, you've chosen to fall over your own foolish code. Foolish code. Then the die is cast, and once again, my blade will taste Nightingale blood. Carlisle, I'll deal with you after I rid myself of your irksome companions. In the meantime, perhaps you and Fridnio should get better acquainted. What? What's happening? I can't stop myself. Damn you, Mercer. Fight it, Fridnio. He's taken control of me. You might have the, the quickness, but I have the damage. And apparently his head. This way. It actually fills up. Holy shit. Where are they? Did they... Did they just leave without me? Or where am I supposed to go? I have no idea where the fuck I'm supposed to go. Shouts. Yeah, but I still can't get up. I can't jump. There we go. Bronze water cave. Sorry, lad. I've got important things to do. We'll speak another time. I can't believe it's over. 25 years in exile and just like that, it's done. Like, just like that. It's done. All that remains is to ensure the safe return of the skeleton key. I'm afraid it's not that simple. When the skeleton key was stolen from the Twilight Sepulchre, our access to the inner sanctum was removed. The only way to bring it back will be through the Pilgrim's Path. Let's do it. It wasn't created for the Nightingales. It was created to test those who wish to serve Nocturnal in other ways. As a consequence, I have no knowledge of what you'll be facing. Brynjolf is needed back at the Thieves' Guild, and I... I can't bear to... I'm afraid you'll have to face the end of your journey. Take this with you. I've had this bow almost my entire life, and it's never let me down. I hope it brings you the same luck. I've been a Nightingale for a very long time. I sold my allegiance to Nocturnal in exchange for many profitable years of thieving. Falling in love with Gallus was wrong. Yes. It was a distraction that allowed the sepulchre to be desecrated, and it likely cost him his life. Until the key is returned, I will never set foot inside that place again. Hmm, okay. The agent of subterfuge utilizes shadow to cloud the judgment of those around him. By weaving the darkness to their will, this agent can manipulate others into fighting for the Nightingale for a limited time. The conduit to Nocturnal's realm, the realm of Everglow... It's been in Skyrim well longer than recorded history. 
The Twilight Sepulchre was constructed. It's through this conduit that we're given Nocturnal's greatest gift. Even though Nocturnal doesn't desire worship in the traditional sense, the Twilight Sepulchre propagated a small group of priests. Of course, they never come into direct contact with Nocturnal, but they insisted they had her favor. As part of their duties, the priests created all sorts of baseless rituals. These priests weren't a threat to the Skeleton Key. So the now it's time to go on the Pilgrim's path. One of their ceremonies involved the Pilgrim's path. A so-called test of worthiness. If a pilgrim was able to complete the path, it was said that they would live forever in twilight. What that means is anyone's <coughs> guess. The agent of stealth is the master of remaining unseen. They are able to manipulate the darkness and use it to their advantage. On moonlit nights or in darkened rooms, this agent literally becomes invisible. The agent of strife. strife can send forth a tendril of pure darkness into the heart of another, causing great injury to them. At the same time, this tether will bolster the agent's own life force, making him stronger. Okay, so do this. Sorry, lad. I've got important things to do. <laughs> it's an insane thing to. So we go to doo -doo 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 -doo. Pilgrim's Path is all the way down here, the south. Okay, so I can go to my own place, put stuff in what I've gathered so far, because I think. No, oh, actually, I could. I could go over there. <laughs> well, what does the bow do damage wise? Uh, nocturnal. 17. I mean, it could work. Oh, what the fuck was that lag thing there? Take this and hold on to it. I'll be back for it later. I'll pay you good. Don't lose it. No time to talk. Snitch or double cross me and I'll kill you. I need it. Who's oh, oh well, another dragon. And a random guy. It seems to. Stand over there. Did you see someone run past just now? Great. Thanks. Bastard stole from me. I'll catch it all. Come on, land. I don't, don't, don't fly. Wait, what was my health? Oh, okay, I, 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 was, I don't want to kill that. I thought that it was going to swallow me. There's fire resistance. Yes? Yes. We killed the guy. Didn't care about the stuff that... So that he gave me. Okay, same armor. I want to level up now, though. We kind of do, but I still don't want to, because I I want to use the the points I have for something else. Like um, 
either use them for for, for upgrading the um, the, um, the the heavy armor or the light armor to start with. So I'm pretty far ahead when I have to use it. I don't know if I should get to like level 100 before I start using 100. Maybe. <coughs> Oh. I didn't get a sentinel. I don't recognize you, but I sense that you're one of us. Who are, Who you? are you? The last of the Nightingale Sentinels, I'm afraid. I've defended this. We were betrayed by one of our own kind. In fact, I was blinded. Blinded by dark. Ah, so probably more so. Got into this. I've been more vigilant. Then Mercer Frey wouldn't have lured me to. I haven't heard that name in a long time. How do you know of me? The key. You have the skeleton key. You have the key. I never thought I'd see it again. And Mercer Frey? Then it's over, and my death wasn't in vain. I owe you a great deal, Nightingale. That's quite a noble sentiment for... My only regret is that you had to undertake the... Carlyle? She's still alive? I feared she'd befallen the same fate, ending up a victim of Mercer's betrayal. Nothing would bring me more pride than to return the key. From the moment I arrived here, the sepulchre isn't merely a temple or a vault to house the key. Within these walls is the Evermare, a conduit. When Mercer stole the key, that conduit... I'm afraid so. I'm weakening. I thought, I okay, I'm soul. just gonna hand it to him and it's fine. The years, but no. Whatever damage has been caused can only be corrected by following the Pilgrim's path to the Evermare and replacing the key. Good luck. The Pilgrim's path. Is this the way? Bit of damage though. I thought he said he was the last. Oh, I see. The person has arrived to help me. Even after they are shooting me in the, f the, in the ass. Oh, what? King, I think I've gotten that before. I get the diamond, did I? Yep. Book of riddles. Silver ingot. Alchemy lab. Still take all the, um, the meat and all that, even though I don't need it. I'm just gonna end up throwing that away afterwards. Or if I have a sp space my inventory, I just sell it. Me. 
you know? But they're spirits, so why should I be able to kill them? I'm just... Call it Pilgrim's Path. Let's heal. Hold on, am I taking damage because of the light? So the light is too bright for me. Hmm. I just want to do this one then. that you know to redness to max earlier is still Precise with the controller. Um, there's something I have to do. This. And this. Yeah. The darkness, the darkness it is. A sanctum. I hope there's a fast way out of this. We don't have to walk through all that shit again. Do we just jump down? See, I can't believe it. I came all this way, solved all these ridiculous riddles just out of here. After I realized it was collected from a slit in the throat. Now I guess the joke's on me because I'm stuck here and I don't know. see a way out. I hope someone comes by soon. I'm getting hungry. So I just have to wait down there or something. Listen to my phone. My mind. What do we have here? It's a been a number of years since I've set foot on your world. Or perhaps it's been moments one tends to lose track. So 
Once again, the key has been stolen, and a champion returns it to the Sepulchre. Now that the Ebonmere has been restored, you stand before me, awaiting your accolades. A pat on your head, a kiss No, I just want to leave. What you failed to realize is your actions were expected, and represent nothing more than the fulfillment of your I know. agreement. Just let me... Don't okay. mistake my tone for displeasure. After all, you've obediently performed your duties to the letter. But we both know this has little to do with honor and oaths and loyalty. It's about the reward, the prize. Fear not. You'll have your trinkets, your desire for power, your hunger for wealth. I bid you to drink deeply from the Ebonmere mortal, for this is where the agent of Nocturnal is. So I drink and become the Nocturnal. The has been struck, the die has been cast, and your fate awaits you in the Everglow. Farewell, See to the king stay this time, won't you? You were able to bring oh, she's. I did not know she was right there. Seemed quite pleased with your efforts. I wouldn't take that to heart. It's her way. Think of her as a scolding mother, continually pushing you harder to be successful, outwardly sounding angry, but silently content. I assure you, had she been displeased with you, we wouldn't be having this conversation. The circles at the base of the Ebonmere imbue you with powers befitting a Nightingale agent. The Crescent Moon represents the agent of Shadow, the Half Moon for the agent of Subterfuge, and the Full Moon for the agent of Strife. This is Nocturnal's way of maintaining balance. Okay, so what am I supposed to be? If you ever feel the need to change your abilities, you can return to the Sepulchre and step onto a different circle. Be warned that once you've chosen, you can't reselect for at least a day. Now, your life as a nightingale begins. Should the need arise, you'll be summoned to the sepulchre in order to okay. defend it. The guild has welcomed me back with open arms. I feel like a void in my life has finally been filled. I only hope that this isn't an ending to things, but actually the beginning. Oh, quite nice beginning. Why, perhaps. The greatest crime spree Skyrim's ever. But it's also like there are pockets stuff happened twenty-five years ago. She was banished and she has been living pick. trying we so nightingales. If you expect her to be pieces. around uh, twenty twenty-five year, it means she's about fifty now. Choose your path. Oh. Your yes. Uh, the agent of subterfuge. By weaving the darkness to their will, this agent can manipulate the agent of stealth is the master of remaining on moonlit nights or in darkened rooms this agent literally become this agent of strife can at the same time this tether will bolster the agent's own life force making him stronger what's this yes fellow nightingale ah damn it what's the wrong one <laughs> 